It's a short love story. Um, it came about through um, RSA Films, who were approached to make a series of films for Cornetto. Um, uh, the teen audience that they wanted to, to, to you know, keep aware of ice creams was not watching television commercials anymore. So they started making uh, short films for them to to watch. So luckily, the the Cornetto client was on board with that. So they they understood that you didn't we shouldn't feature the product at all because that would turn people off. So that you know that left us as filmmakers with this much more open brief to. To, to be able to tell a story without any constraints, really. You know, there was a format for each film where you had to have, um, you know, there was a love story that had a uh, had trouble um, fulfilling itself, and you had to have a cupid character who would intervene. But and the, also the other parameter was that because they were shown globally, you couldn't really have much dialogue. Uh, this one was uh, for the Russian market mainly, so we. Had a, we cast it in Moscow and shot it in Krakow. Um, we shot it in a furniture store in a delightful trading estate in Krakow in two night shoots. Um, and yeah, the, we did run out of time because the daylight came up, but we did all right, I think. My film is The Library of Own Books. Uh, it's um, screening in the drama and the family-friendly sections. I suppose it's a, it's a science fiction fantasy uh, about book burning, uh, which uh, blends live action and animation, and uh, is inspired by the poetry of William Blake. My plan is to see a lot of short films. I particularly want to see some of the comedy shorts because I would like to make a comedy film, and I want to see... I'd like to know what the difference between a, a comedy short and a sketch is, and I think... Uh, it's interesting to look at the, the the short films which are which work as films and the short films which are really just good really good high production value sketches